The four-seat Mooney single prop plane plunged suddenly into a grove of trees Wednesday near a Watertown park. All of a sudden I heard this zoom and I was like, okay, there's an airplane probably from the airport in town. Um, and then we heard a boom. That boom was felt throughout the area and we're learning killed the 73-year-old pilot from Watertown and his eight-year-old grandson from Waukesha. Investigators have spent the day back at the site here where the wreckage was spread out across this soccer field. The main part of the plane itself in those trees just beyond the end of the field. When it crashed, the plane was just three miles from the Watertown Airport, where it had just taken off from moments earlier, on a planned flight up north to Manitowish Waters. 12 News spotted a team from the National Transportation Safety Board and the Federal Aviation Administration at the airport hangar, where the parts will be examined. Much of Thursday was spent transporting the wreckage to the hangar. It really just sounded like it was flying very low. Investigators will collect as much information as they can from witnesses and the wreckage itself to determine, if they can, what led to this family tragedy. In Watertown, Nick Bohr, WISN 12 News.